in 1833. There was a copper wire, which they used for communicating via binary code. When Carl Friedrich Gauss and Wilhelm Weber, the physicist, developed the first electromagnetic telegraph of the world. And this application laid the cornerstone for modern telecommunication. At that time, Carl Friedrich Gauss was the director of the observatory. Here he was working and living. Göttingen is a very modern university, which at the same time has a long history. In the beginning of the 20th century, many important mathematicians did their research here in Göttingen. These days, I'm working on my master's thesis here at the Institute for Mathematical Stochastics in Göttingen. I'm working on blind separation using multi-scale techniques. It has an important application in cancer genetics. I hope that one day geneticists will use my results to detect copy number variations in cancer cells. One real nice thing about Göttingen is the uh, close collaboration between the different uh, institutes that we have. So we are working, for example, on applied topology and applied geometry, but we are closely collaborating with the Institute of Mathematical Stochastics because there are many questions which are interesting also from a statistical perspective. So students learn both aspects, topological aspects and aspects of statistics. Topology and geometry also play um, a significant role, especially geometry does in physics. And what you can see here are so-called elastic rods that if you twist one end while you hold the other end fixed, then they form these plectonemes. And some of you may still remember these structures from the times when telephones had cords and then you would have this annoying tangling up of your telephone cord. In our research group, we are developing a theory for good public transportation systems. As a partner from practice, we are working with the Danish railways. As a student, during my master's degree, I've already been working with scientists from this research group. The atmosphere is very familiar. You can approach anyone. Everyone here is very helpful if you've got any problems. This is the place where I learned to work in a team. The level of the courses is very high, but in my opinion it pays off to invest yourself. The courses are organized in cycles, including lectures, seminars and tutorials. Several cycles start every year and continue for the whole program. With these cycles you are perfectly prepared for your master thesis. Our almost 30 professors cover a huge variety of mathematical topics. In Göttingen we've got big departments for pure and applied mathematics. For example, we consider minimal surfaces. What do complex numbers have to do with soap bubbles? I myself would like to do a PhD in Göttingen. It's possible to choose a topic between math and physics that connects both fields. After the master's thesis it's possible to pursue one of our PhD programs, such as mathematical structures in modern quantum physics. And this is a program at the interface of pure mathematics and theoretical physics. We have a number of international students from all over the world who are currently working within this program and all of these programs are part of the graduate school Gauss here in Göttingen. Gauss, the prince of mathematics, he made several important contributions in mathematics such as normal or Gauss distribution. The historical importance of Göttingen was a good reason for me to choose this university. Other important reasons to come here were the low cost of living and the spoken standard German, also Hochdeutsch. You can live directly in the city center. I, for example, live in the house where Gauss used to live while he was in Göttingen. That's something really special. There are short ways. You can use your student ID as a ticket for the city bus but you can also take the train with it for free and go to Hamburg or Kassel. Getting is in the center of Germany. During my masters, I've been studying in Seville. Going abroad is not a problem. I've been in Birmingham, UK for three months in order to write my master thesis. I wanted to go to Edinburgh and it worked out. The student advisory service helps you a lot with the organization of your semester abroad. The mathematicians are quite good connected also in Göttingen. The city itself is a real student city with a broad variety of ideas for living, such as those common gardens where everyone can basically participate. 
This is the grave of Gauss. And even from here, you can see the Gauss Weber laser after sunset. <laughs>